Welcome back YouTubers. We're back. We're here with another video. Uh, today we're working on a separate seam belt. This is how you change it out. First step first, take the bolts off right there. It's a 10, right? 10. Two of them. One here, one there. Take this sucker out of the way. And then, what you got there? What the? I thought it was a mouse. So that was part of the serpentine belt. Yeah. As Sorry. you can see, it's not supposed to look this thing. Holy sh! <laughs> All bad. That was that's a thin wire, guys. Um, we got the new one. Oh yeah, I'm the gonna go one. ahead and post it on. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, post the link. Post the link below. Post the link. Always you want to go OEM or OE spec. So. We get more stuff out of there. Oh my, oh my goodness. Oh, oh my, oh my, oh my God, bro. Are you kidding me? What happened? Oh my God, this thing did some damage. Did it really? Yeah, oh my God, bro. I gotta go down there and get all this off. Oh my God, that's hot. Just uh, take the belt off. So. Yeah. So highly recommended. But you can do it with a regular one. With the motor side, you could get in with the, with this sucker. What size is that bolt? For your um, for your pulley. The pulley one. That one right there, just that. Huh? Just that. Oh. All right, so. The other wrench. Oh my God, bro, this thing fucked my shit up. Holy fuck. Oh my God. Can we do it? Yeah, yeah. Whoa. And right here, I'm going to need that Allen wrench. And just loop. Just get like a Allen ah. wrench or something. Yep, right there, put the Allen wrench through that. Uh. Remove this. Alright guys, the belt's ready to just slide off now. Should. Slide off. It is. Try to do this when the, the vehicle's not as hot. Yeah, I would do it. Highly recommend it. But burn. if you're a risk taker. Like, uh, like me. And you don't mind having burn marks all over your arm. Hey, give it a try while it's hot. Hella, it's hella fun. <laughs> My friends would say. Is this soft? We need some more. That's it's caught here. Yeah, I've got it. Underneath there. Okay. Oh. Alright. Uh oh. There you go, guys. Oh my god, bro. I can't believe it. God, I barely like made it here. Look at that shoe shoe spring. Holy fuck! Yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, oh, the diagram. We didn't we didn't draw out the diagram. Gotta look it up. All right, guys, we're gonna look up the diagram. For the viewers, we'll show you we'll show you guys right now. Diagram real quick. And pretty much put it back. So you guys could probably just use a regular wrench with a, an extension. Well, not a wrench, but a... A 
Racha. Racha. Right below there. Where about that pool? That's where you put it in, and then just maybe get a bolt or something. Just loosen it and just put those 10 mils back, one there, you know, one there. So, hopefully, this video helps you guys out. Make, make sure you guys subscribe. I know this was a quick video. Um, oh, yeah. Peace. So, yeah, this is pretty much for the infinities, you guys. Thirty-seven, G37, Q50, Q50s, um, G35s, anything with the V, VHR uh, motor. And the way you can tell is right here. So this is the V, VQ37. That's from Japan, you guys. Yeah, make sure you guys subscribe. This is a little quick shorty here, another quick short video, and hopefully it helps you guys out. See you guys in the next one.